Breaking news. Ukraine has launched its long-awaited major offensive on the southern front. Western tanks and IFVs like the Leopard 2 and the American Bradley were seen taking part in large formations attempting to break through Russian-held positions in the Zaporizhia region, marking the start of the offensive. U.S. officials said, the Ukrainian assault in the southern region of Zaporizhia appeared to be the main thrust of its long-awaited counteroffensive, but cautioned that Russia is putting up a stiff resistance and Ukraine is suffering heavy losses. Ukrainian and Western officials have warned that the counteroffensive would be difficult, even with modern NATO standard equipment. The Russians have prepared multi-layered defensive lines in Zaporizhia, including minefields, trenches, and tank traps. Russian sources reported wave after wave of Ukrainian infantry and armor attacks in the south of the country for the fourth consecutive day. Russian Minister of Defense Sergei Shoigu claimed Moscow forces had defeated a large attack by Ukraine's 47th Mechanized Brigade in a two-hour battle. Independent geolocated images confirmed the battle and suggested Ukraine may have committed advanced Western weapons. Ukraine is also engaged in fierce battles with Russian forces near Chasiv Yar, a town west of Bakhmut. Russia has performed well on defense initially, but Ukraine's offensive just started and could last for months. Ukraine's main goal is to break Russian lines in Zaporizhia and threaten the land bridge that connects Russia to occupied Crimea, paving the way for a possible future attempt to capture the contested peninsula. A Ukrainian defense official declined to confirm the offensive and suggested the reports were exaggerated. As the offensive begins, the situation is shrouded in a heavy fog of war and Intel Drop will strive to provide you with the most recent and accurate updates. Thanks for watching.